Hi, and welcome to Synergy's how-to series. In this tutorial, we'll go over how to view clips in the Synergy Baseball app and send clips to the Synergy Editor. This process is the same on a PC and a Mac. To view clips in the Synergy Baseball app, once you've created a report, select either Player to send clips to the in-app video player, Editor to send clips to the Synergy Editor, or compare to view clips side by side in the in-app player from the options at the top left of the application window. We'll go over the compare feature in more detail in another video. Click the play button above the chart display to launch the video. You can send all clips or individually select the clip you want to send by holding down the control key and clicking on the specific clip or clips that you want. Select a group of clips by clicking and dragging to select an area on the chart display. Additionally, selecting a row in the data chart below allows you to view the associated clips. The clip count will appear to the left of the play icon. The player option uses the app's built-in video player. This is active by default. When viewing video in player mode, you can also send playlists to the Synergy Editor. This is done by selecting the down arrow icon in the player window. The editor option sends playlists directly to the Synergy Editor, where you can create custom edits, trim clips, and review video. You also can switch to the side-by-side -side player by selecting Compare at the bottom of the player. The in-app player contains a variety of controls to make the most of your experience. Starting in the upper left, the return arrow returns you to the Synergy Baseball app from the in-app player. Click Full At Bat to expand the At Bat data associated with the current clip or set of clips. Click again to return to Playlist View. Use the radio button to show or hide pickoff attempts within the Playlist View. Toggle the selected clips as a list view or see them charted. Adjust the clip duration by using the drop-down to choose between Standard or Extended. Extended will play all available video between pitches. Set the time in the clip prior to the release of the pitch by using the drop-down menu. The default is 3 seconds. Located to the left of the camera icon, you can use multi-angle view to view multiple camera angles when available. View detailed pitch info, including pitch type and pitch velocity, when available. The player controls include play, pause, jump to beginning of clip, previous clip, back one frame, playhead scrubber, forward one frame, next clip, jump to end of clip, send clips to editor, or enter full screen. The stopwatch feature allows you to define an area within a clip. Use the in button to set the start point and the out button to set the stop point. The timekeeper to the right will show you the length of your selected clip. You can adjust the set points by clicking and dragging the pin above the playback scrubber. To remove the set point, click the in or out button again. We hope that we've answered any questions you may have about playing video in the video player and sending video to the editor. Should you have trouble or need more information, please feel free to contact our support team at any time. Thanks for watching.